Hello everyone and welcome to my mini review video of the Pixel 8 Pro official case. I've never done a video like this before where it's just like a little review of a thing that doesn't really need like a full 10, 20 minute video, but just needs like a little five or whatever minute video. I thought it'd be cool to start with this case though. I've been using this case since the 8 Pro launched, which was about 10 months ago, I believe. So not a full year of usage out of this thing because, you know, Google had a odd release this year where they released stuff in August instead of October like usual. So definitely less usage than you would get out of a full year, but still fairly close. And I just want to give you guys my thoughts on this case. Now, straight off the bat, this is one of the grippiest cases I've ever used. This is a seriously, seriously grippy silicone case. Although I will say this is my only silicone case I've ever tried. I don't think I've ever tried another silicone case before. So probably just my lack of experience, but this is seriously grippy. It has some pretty nice textured buttons on the side here for the power and the volume rocker. Definitely makes stuff easier to press and feel around to make sure you're pressing the right button. It also has this recessed Google logo right here that's made of a probably a similar material as, as the volume rocker button so pretty nice cool little detail looks pretty good now taking it to the inside of the case we have this really nice fabric that's very soft to the touch it has a really nice texture to it and it's held up pretty good over the 10 months i've used this phone it has a nice little pixel logo engraving right here so that's cool little detail and overall it hasn't gotten super dirty from uh, normal usage, I'd say I'm a bit heavier on phones than the average person. Not like super heavy, but like enough to be above average. So I would say that this held pretty well and the, uh, the actual texture hasn't really changed much. You can also see the power button and volume rocker right here where it presses down when you press down the button. So cool. Overall, this case has held pretty well. I will say I have a few scuffs like that, like just chunks taken out of it. And also on the front, you can see I have a little bit of a thing here that, that just has gotten uh, a chunk taken out of it. This usually happens when I drop the phone on like a hard surface. So I guess it's kind of expected to have some scuffs and some chunks taken out of it. It's doing its job. It's protecting my phone. My phone could have had a chunk taken out of it. So I'm, I appreciate that it's doing its job. You can also see on like the corners that the silicone texture has smoothed out quite a bit. That's just from general usage. You know, I my corners probably rub against stuff quite a bit, so makes sense. Overall though, I do really like this case and I like how grippy it is. It's a very nice case to use. I think my biggest gripe with it is it does get kind of greasy. The silicone texture kind of gets a little oily at times and you might have to wash it off with some water or some rubbing alcohol, but still pretty good. I really like its grippy texture. I, I would, I think I'm gonna pick up another one of these for the Pixel 9 Pro just because it. I had a good experience with it. They're definitely a bit pricey at launch, like 30 35 bucks, I believe. So not the best value out there, but if you want a case that was designed from the ground up, specifically to fit the Pixel 8 Pro or whatever Pixel you want. This is definitely a really nice case. There also isn't a super good protection on the visor. I mean, it's honestly, I don't think it needs a lot of protection. I think this lip does a good job of keeping most stuff out of the visor, but just something to keep in mind if you want the best protective case. It's not the best protective case in the world, but it is very stylish. In conclusion, I give this case probably an eight out of 10 in terms of rating. It only took two points off just for the uh, greasiness that, that happens at times. I think it's a great case. I definitely recommend it if you want an official first party case designed straight from Google for the phone. So yeah, pretty good case. And I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini review of the Google Pixel 8 Pro Coral case. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching.